You know what? You need to add the fact that you can come to your dating resume. Girl, what the fuck is a dating resume? Dating resume. You know whatever you tell women about yourself before the date? Duh. That shit sounds awful. How so? Well, for some people, it means being low in your heart, and for others, it means being low physically. Hmm. Don't look at me like that. I know what you're thinking. Honestly, it just kind of sounds like an excuse to be a hoe to me. I don't know. I just, I just get like a friend of the fiber. I'm gonna smash it like that. It's gonna be something kind of funny and make their little leg wrap around it. Ma'am, I do not sleep in a little bit. So you live in the loop? Oh, I see how you are. I'm just making conversation. Hey. Right. Chris, I think we need to separate for a while. What? I'm not happy. I'm sorry. So you think the reason you cheated on Chris is because you got married too young and missed out on your hoe phase? I mean, when you put it that way, maybe. <laughs> My bad, I, I just saw your text. Uh, no problem, I was in the area here. Might as well come drop off the deposit. Hi, I'm Dee. Nice to meet you, Dee. Chris. Nice to meet you, Chris. This is the artist I was telling you about, Demetria. She's extremely talented. Sabrina came to my open house today. Mm -hmm. Bitch, I know you're every move, even if you're not on social media. Let's start by you telling me why you're here today. Well, Monica suggested that we attend couples counseling together. And what prompted her to make that suggestion? Because after she cheated on me with half of Houston, I figured we may need to speak to a professional about our issues. Me and Denise are definitely on a break, so if you're serious, maybe we should talk about being roommates. Really? I'm definitely not moving back in with D anytime. You know, if I had to put money on one of us fleeing marriage, it would have been Brooklyn. 